Morning to you, Katie. And talking of frustration, I imagine there's quite a few frustrated commuters this morning. Is there any sign of a resolution over this? Not as yet, Charlotte. In fact, much of the north of England will be a standstill today. You can hear these guys. They're saying, keep the guard on the train. The ones you can see in the high visits are guards. They would effectively lose their jobs in 2020 if Aretha Rail North have their way and make the trains driver only. But the strike's going to affect hundreds of thousands of people going to major hubs in the north. I was joined by John Tilley from the RMT Union. John, you really couldn't have picked a worse time. Bank holiday, people still have to go to work today. Can you justify this? Well, there's no great day to go on strike, is there? And our people are losing money because they're determined to defend safety. This is not about today. This is about the next 30 years. How are we going to run the trains in the north of England? Are we going to have trains with just a driver on, locked in the cab on their own, or is there going to be that critical second person inside the train? We've got over 300 stations here in the north that are completely unstaffed and we're proposing the, to add the toxic mix of having no guards on trains. That's not acceptable, and the public know that. Well, we spoke to some of the public this morning, thank you, John, and it was a mixed reaction to the strikes today. It's obviously a bit of a pain, but nothing I can do. We need guards. Safety. Don't get rid of the guards. Bank holidays, is, it's not great. You know, it's, it's having a... It's having a negative effect, I would say, not 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 necessarily a positive one. On the train, keep the guard. On the train, well, Arriva Rail North said that they the need train, to modernise the, the railway on the train, and they want to get back the round the table, as the do the train, RMT. But for today, the uh, this on could go on for quite a lot longer. Southern Rail still in dispute after a year.